Peggy 3. All around the world, farmers know farming is an art. Like life, we know it can be hard. And it can be surprising, too. But sometimes it's about being at the right place at the right time. A wise man once said that the best lessons are learned under the wide open sky. I think the same thing can be said about our art. Yeah, it can be messy, but it's always beautiful. So beautiful it can help you see yourself and the world in all new ways. The art of farming, the soil is the canvas, the seeds are the paint, and the harvest is the masterpiece. Hey, this is pretty good. Yeah. It's pretty darn good. Is it missing something? You're too cute to eat. Maybe some fresh spinach for a change? Okay, so that is the first CGI trailer for Farm Simulator 25, which is coming on November the 12th for PC, Mac, PlayStation 5, and Xbox Series XS. So personally, I'm looking forward to this. The biggest takeaway from that trailer was obviously the rice. So we've got rice paddies in the game now. We have two types of rice, which have been confirmed, and also spinach, which was briefly mentioned at the very end of the video. That is also a confirmed new crop. Um, also, there was the dirt bike in there, so it looks like we're going to be getting dirt bikes as a base game vehicle that we can ride around our farms on. And also, there was a bit of harvesting in there with the John Deere combine and tractor as well. And a little bit of cultivating with the new case quad track. So, yeah, there's probably a lot more things if you deep dive into there and that you can pick up on. But we do have some more information that's been provided by Giants as well. Uh, regarding some of the new features so we're going to have a new Giants Engine 10 so improved visuals and game mechanics also we're going to have a more dynamic weather effect system uh, fog ground deformation which is one that sounds very interesting as well be great to hear more about that one uh, again over the coming weeks and months as we get close to the release and seeing how that's actually going to work is it going to be restricted to fields or is it going to be across the entire map? So, yeah, sounds interesting. But again, at this point, it's still very early. And, yeah, it's going to be over time before we see more in-depth on the features and what's to come in the new game. So it does also mention there's going to be new productions, new construction opportunities, uh, three new maps as well. So we're getting a Central European map, North American map, and also the East Asian themed map, which kind of highlighted in the trailer and some of the screenshots as well uh, there's 150 brands and um, over 400 items of equipment and vehicles in the base game as well so yeah there's going to be a lot to uh look through when it comes out i'm looking forward to the fact sheet friday starting so we can see more information on the upcoming vehicles and equipment so that should be interesting as well so also released is the information on the upcoming collector's edition, which is available on PC only. So this includes the collector's box, the USB ignition lock, which allows you to turn off the engines in game. So using the key and the box, 
Uh, we've also got the PC Gamer Macdon Pack is included. So the Macdon Pack is the pre-order bonus pack that you can get if you pre-order the game. Uh, there's also the 16-bit retro edition. So Sega Mega Drive 16-bit retro edition of the game. A keychain, three times A2 posters, which I presume looking at that, it looks like there's going to be one for each map. So one side is going to be the map. And on this back side here, it looks like there's going to be a crop rotation calendar. Um, I did zoom in on that to try and see what crops were on there. And it's difficult to make out. Um, but it does look like there's quite a lot more new crops included. Uh, some potentially look like uh, peas, one of them. I'm not sure if it is. Or I know in the East region, uh, peanuts, I think when I looked up, peanuts, spinach, rice, uh, tea and coffee are like obviously very well-grown crops in that region. So possibly tea, coffee, peanuts, maybe, who knows. Uh, but definitely two types of rice and spinach, which have been confirmed. There's also the New Holland CR11 Gold Edition Combine, 32 brand stickers and the modern tutorials for FS25. So yeah, quite a bit in the collector's edition. Again, that's available to pre-order and is released on November the 12th, 2024 for PC only. So they've also released some information on the year one season pass for Farm Simulator 25. So this can include four packs and one expansion. So first one starting in quarter one of 2025 with the innovative machinery. Then we've got quarter two, performance on plains and prairies, and then third quarter, the stars align. And then fourth quarter of 25, which will be around November, I imagine is deep dive into a new map. So looking at this one now, that looks a very, very British map to me. So I'm really looking forward to that as I didn't think we'd ever get a kind of British style map from Giants. So yeah, it's gonna be interesting to see that when it's released and more information and hopefully some British style equipment uh, to go with that map as well. Similar to what we had with Silver and Forest, where it wasn't just the map, there was a lot of equipment to suit that map as well and Zilonka. So yeah, looking forward to getting some more information on that, but that's obviously some way off yet as we haven't even got the, uh, the actual core game until this November. So yeah, there we go. That is Farming Simulator 25, the first CGA trailer, uh, CGI trailer and some information on the Season Pass Collector's Edition as well and a few screenshots. So Farmcon coming up, we're going to get some more information from Farmcon. They'll probably show off some of the, some teasers of one of the new maps and some of the new features. So I'm looking forward to that. So keep an eye out for that and get some more information. And then at some point, we'll start the Fact Sheet Fridays which each week we'll get some information on some new equipment and vehicles, assuming that they're going to do that again this year, as they have done previously with other releases. So yeah, let me know what your thoughts are in the comments. It'd be interesting to hear. Is it something you're looking forward to? Obviously, there's still a lot more to come, a lot more features to be announced and shown off. So at the moment, it's still very early days, and obviously a lot of these screenshots are early production screenshots. So Subject to change as well, so just bear that in mind. So yeah, let me know in, you, in the comments your thoughts. Let me know if you are going to be pre-ordering it yourself, or you're going to hold on to see more of uh, what's to come before you make a decision. And if you are considering pre-ordering and you're going to get through Giants, there is a link in the description. And it is an affiliate link, so I will earn a small commission, no extra cost to you. And if you are ordering anything from Giants website directly, then please do consider using my partner code SimPharma, all one word which again helps support the channel at no extra cost to you. So a big thank you for watching. As I say, I'm really looking forward to this and looking forward to seeing more over the coming weeks and months. So yeah, hopefully we'll see you in the uh, East Asia harvesting some rice in November. So again, thank you for watching. Take care and see you in the next one. Goodbye.